Well, everybody, I got good news and bad news. Good news is, I got sh new shirts. I just got the shirt in the mail today, and I got myself a hat. Yeah. But now for the bad news. Well, the bad news is that uh, we got word today that we won't be able to get the little girl. Uh, apparently, uh, well, last Friday we went and we met the little girl and um, we chit-chatted with the caseworker and everything and uh, apparently the state doesn't see us to be that fit of parents to take care of this little four-year-old girl. So today, um, we got word from the father, her, Crystal's brother, who is the dad of little Lily, that um, the state decided not to make us placement for Lily and that she was just going to stay in the care of the state. However, the girl, the lady that was taking care of Lily, uh, had a family emergency and had to take off. So they took little four-year-old Lily and put her in a group home. So needless to say, I'm not in a very good mood. So I'm going to kind of make this, keep this video short, or I'm going to start to rant, and that's going to be very bad. So, um, I haven't been very motivated today, other than getting this stuff. Kind of happy about that. But uh, I'll show you what I've done so far today. Well, I took the hub off of the brake. So you got the brake disc, and then you've got the hub. That's what this is always called. And sometimes I'll mix the screw up and I'll call the whole thing a hub, but, you know, like especially when it comes to tires and stuff. But this right here, the white thing, is a hub <laughs> but I painted that white and I painted the bolts geez, I painted the bolts white so kind of stands out a little bit and what I should have done but I didn't do is I should have painted the inside see where the rust is at I should have painted that black because it would make this white stand out a lot better so what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to uh, I painted this hub also for the sprocket, but what I'm going to do now is I'm going to paint the sprocket black and just the nat natural wear from the chain will clean off the paint so it's no big deal there. So I can paint this whole dang thing black if I want to, but first got to clean it, get all that rust off of there. thinner there we go just clean off all that grit crap that's collected now um, hmm. I'd like to prop it up 
but oh use my harbor freight file now I gotta find my paint oh flat black went down got some more there we go. That's what I should do. I should build some little electric motor that has a vibrator that goes up and down like this. And then that way I can put my paint in it and it'll shake my paint like that. Wait. Okay. Come on, girl. You can do it. Now I've been told that the secret to good painting is the first coat that you put down. But I've always found that the secret to good painting is to always have somebody else do it. Whoa, come on now. I guess it's not really all that important to teeth because first time it starts to rotate. <coughs> oh, I guess I'm getting all sorts of high. <laughs> Okay, so now I just did the disc break, the disc for the break, and uh, you can kind of see uh, I got more paint towards the center and out towards the middle here, and didn't want to put much here because that's where the pads make contact. What I'll most likely do is once this, once this all gets dried, I'll take uh, some lacquer thinner on and a rag, and I'll go around it and remove a lot of that paint off of there so that way I don't have to worry about the paint getting too hot and caking up onto the onto the pads of the brake and that sort of stuff on the, on the caliper uh, but at least it'll be black with the white hub and it should look pretty decent pretty neat when I'm done and um, yeah so I'll let that dry for a little bit and uh, I just, you know, I got the sprocket there all drying, and once I I'll get that all okay, I took off the low light here. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Huh. Now this is a shiny, uh, glossy white. It was kind of like regular white, but the black is flat black. So, and now what I'm doing is I got the hub painted up. For the sprocket. And I have that sitting there, and I s painted the nuts that will hold it on, and uh, yeah, it should look pretty good when I'm done. All right, well there we go. That's kind of nice, huh? Yeah. Wish I could put a little bit thicker coat on there, but this is there's some rust on here, and and. Uh, yeah, but still, it still comes out look pretty nice. Yeah. All right. Well, that's what they look like when they're all painted up. Oh, pretty good. It's really nice. I'm sure, this is. I'm sure this will probably turn out looking really cool. 
Huh. Alright guys, so that's what I've got going on. Uh, that's what I did tonight. And uh, hopefully it, uh, you know, some of you guys out there, since winter's coming and school's already started, it could be a good time for you to strip your machine down and make a little, a few little cosmetic changes and alterations to make it look a little better. But anyways, yeah, so uh, if you guys haven't done so yet, go check out the other shirts uh, that I have listed below in the description of this video. And uh, tell me what you think of the t-shirts. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.